Hey guys, welcome to today's video. I am doing my first clothing unboxing of a subscription service. So as you can tell from the title, I am doing Nordstrom subscription service, which is called Trunk Club. So the cool thing about Trunk Club is you go onto their app or on the website, you fill out a quiz. It's a pretty simple, short quiz to gather what you're looking for, what your style is like, and they curate a box for you of specific items. But my favorite thing about Trunk Club is that they give you like a preview. So you're not like totally in shock when you get your box and you can swap things out if something on the list isn't like what you're looking for or maybe you already have something like that but you can only switch it out once but i do like the fact that they do that for you if you haven't tried trunk club before i have a link down below which will give you 50 dollars off your first box i believe i wish i would have done that uh but i forgot that, that was like a perk that they offer but the styling fee is $25. And then if you get anything from the box, that styling fee will go towards your purchase. So pretty straightforward. This is not sponsored by Trunk Club by any means, but I've never done them before. And I always love unboxing videos. I think they're so fun, that element of surprise. But if you guys are new here, make sure you hit that subscribe button down below. My name is Taylor and you can find tons of fashion content on this channel. And before I get started, I do wanna mention everything will be linked down below. And and today's video is sponsored by Ana Luisa. So I've talked about them before on my channel and they are a jewelry brand. They specialize in sustainable jewelry, which I think we should all try and strive for when it comes to adding to our jewelry collection. They are like your timeless pieces that you can wear every single day that will not bother you, that look classic, that will just elevate any sort of outfit you have on. I have the same pieces that I shared in the last video, but I'm gonna share it again here. This bracelet, I will have the names of everything down below as well as like a picture on the side, but this bracelet is absolutely one of my favorites. It just sparkles in the light. I mean, how do you pass that up? I have a second one as well, but I'm having a hard time getting it on, so I'll show a picture of it over here, but they're very similar and just a different like links, but they're so amazing. I love that they have this little like dangling feature here just to like give it something a little different. This necklace, the second one here is so stunning on any skin tone. It's really just going to add that perfect amount of shimmer and sparkle. But my new favorite, usually I always wear my studs are these little like oval style hoops. They're so comfortable on the ear. They just give you something a little different than like your normal hoop with it being an oval. They have a couple different sizes in these. So if you want something a little bit more substantial, they do have a larger size hoop. Um, but again, I will have everything linked down below. Their jewelry starts at $39. So it's a great price point for the quality. I've worn these pieces in the shower, working out, slept in them, and I've never ever had an issue. They've never turned my skin green. One of my favorite things about them is that they never snag on my skin, particularly the bracelets never snag in my arm hair, which can be such an irritation for me and will drive me nuts. Um, so I love their bracelets for that and then as well as this style necklace I feel like usually I've had issues with other brands like kinking or just like kind of snagging on my skin But these are so unbelievably comfortable that I sleep in them So if you're looking for a Christmas gift for any lady in your life Whether it's a coworker, a neighbor your sister-in-law mother-in-law literally anybody I feel like these pieces are unmatched again for the price and I do have a discount code with Ana Luisa so I'll leave it on the screen and in the description box as well so you can save a little bit of money when you go to check out but let's go ahead into the trunk and try everything on so I can give you a review of all the pieces so the first thing that I want to talk about from my trunk and they send you a little like brochure basically outlining everything that's in your trunk and then as well as the price but you can also find that information on the app if you would prefer to look at it that way but I got a pair of Ray-Bans in this trunk now I usually try to get something a little bit more affordable when it comes to sunglasses because of my kids um, either they end up finding them and they're playing with them and I just don't want to spend something crazy on sunglasses when I know that there's a potential of them to get damaged but I did have a pair of Ray-Bans for about 10 or 11 years and they were like my holy grail sunglasses so I thought it would be 
fun just to have like a nicer pair for date nights or if I'm like out and about doing something by myself. Um, but these, I don't know if the style is on here, but I'll have all the information on the screen like I always do. But these are a more like round frame. They are a little bit, they're like classic, but I know that they're trendy right now. I don't know how I like them on my particular face. Obviously a lot of people can pull them off. I just don't know if they're for me. Something about this style, like classic round frame or like the three blind mice, you know, like just the circular black frame. So leave me a comment down below. Do you think these look all right on my face? Would you suggest I keep them? I don't know. Like I don't want to spend the money on them if I'm not like head over heels. Of course, something this luxury I should be like ooing and awing over. Um, but they are a gold frame, a very delicate looking and they feel super weightless on the face, which I love. I don't like anything that pinches or is aggravating that's gonna give me a headache. And Ray-Ban usually just always hit the nail on the head for me. So these are super cute and um, I do like them. I just don't know if they're the right style for me. Next up are a pair of sweatpants. So these were the only sweatpants or like athleisure type pants that were in this trunk. And this is by the brand Aloe or Aloe. They are a more luxury brand for sure. And I love that for Trunk Club, you can try more luxury pieces in your home versus having to go to the store or forking out the money up front. Um, and then if they don't work out, you have to return them. But anyways, these are $98 and they're a very thick, heavy ribbed material. I like that it is like a thinner waistband for my leggings and like comfort wear I do like a thinner waistband and then they do have one pocket on the back with the two pockets in the front so I'm always a pocket lover I just love being able to like shove my phone or like little kid things in my pockets if need be they look like they're I haven't tried it on yet but I will have clips of me trying everything on of course but they look like they're gonna be kind of long but the try on will show there is a little cuff here but they feel super comfy super cozy I do live in the Midwest so I definitely need something a little bit more thicker and higher quality um, in my fabric for the fall and winter months because it gets so frigid where I live so I do like pants like this again for just lounging around the house or picking up my daughter from preschool taking her to preschool just something easy that I can dress up maybe with like an oversized shirt like this and yeah good to go throw on a basic and then speaking of basics they did send me this made well tank this is super classic of a style it doesn't have a v-neck or anything just a classic crew neck it does have some pretty normal sleeve length and nothing too long or too short and it does have a scoop hem so for this t-shirt it is $19.50 which I feel like is a reasonable price for something as basic as this now I will say this is not the softest material it definitely feels like 100% cotton there is a little bit of stretch in this but like Target and Airy American Eagle definitely has softer t-shirts and I can tell just by looking at it that it is going to be a little bit more see-through so I will definitely have to wear like a nude undergarment with this which is fine you just got to be aware of those things but I would say for $19.50 I'd rather just buy a basic from a Target because we all know that white basics are going to get dingy after a while and you're going to end up throwing them out so I would rather just get a basic from like Old Navy or Target and call it a day because I feel like you can find them there for like eight or ten dollars all right so moving on to jeans so I had three jeans in this trunk and I specifically asked for good American so the nice thing with trunk club is that you have the option to like write in a little text box at the end of your style quiz and specifically write in if there's like a specific brand or a specific piece of apparel that you're really looking to add to your collection and I requested a good American I have one pair of good American jeans and I absolutely love them they are a little bit more expensive but I feel like they are so worth every single penny they just fit like a dream truly so I asked for more like a baggy or looser styles so this first pair here is a black pair and on the tag it says that these are their good girlfriend and then specifically on the pocket which I like they have like a little description about this specific pair so this one reads they are the best weekend jean made a little loose in the leg with a laid-back mid rise 
These are a 25 and a half inseam and I am a true zero 25 I would say in good American and most retailers. So this specific wash I like. You guys know if you've seen other videos of mine I really enjoy a good pair of black jeans for the fall and winter months and the fact that these are a little bit more like acid and worn and lived in just add a little bit more character to them. They feel like heavy weight quality which again for the fall and winter where I live is crucial. There's nothing really like too crazy in terms of the distressing. I'm not a huge fan of distressing So there's just like a little bit on the knees and there's some cuffing on the bottom These do look like they're gonna be pretty long and they're gonna be good to wear with like combat boots Which I know are huge right now in terms of like trends and even like ankle booties Maybe even some golden goose dupes or something like that just to give it a little bit more flair But yeah, so far I can tell just by feeling them that they feel of amazing quality i just don't know how baggy they're going to look on me once they're on because girlfriend boyfriend type jeans can be a little tricky if you're more petite like i am and by the way i will have my measurements or my, like my stats down below if you're in similar sizing to me all right next up these are also good american as i mentioned these are the good curve straight jeans and it says that these are lifting contouring straight cut jean with flat tummy tech and a gap proof waistband and sculpting denim now i did try these on prior to this video so you will get like my true uh thoughts on these these are everything that you would want in a jean specifically a straight jean so these are in a zero or 25 i am almost debating on sizing up to a two in these i need to figure out like how the exchange policy is with trunk club but these are so dreamy on they really do lift your butt and make your behind look incredible they make it look like you have more than what you actually have i will say that they are so stretchy and they just feel like butter on i am so picky when it comes to jeans and their comfort level and these are going to be worth every single penny now these specific ones are 140 dollars, and i can tell you that they are worth it I can't stress that enough so if you're in the market for a good pair of jeans if you don't want to invest in like having four or five different jeans and you just like want a go-to grab and go never fail you type of jean this one is it i can promise you that the last pair of jeans are their what are these these are called their good vintage and it says that these are vintage inspired straight leg jean with flat tummy tech and a gap proof waistband these are in an inseam of 28 inches and these are in a 025 um, i did try these on prior to this video because i was very curious and they are just okay um there is nothing crazy there is no distressing it's just like a very vintage style like mom jean in my opinion and i don't know if they really do anything for my style or my taste or my figure although i could see this working really well for somebody that's maybe like more pear shape um something along that line um i just don't feel like they really do anything for my figure so with that being said maybe give these a go if you're more pear shape um, because i feel like they would look really bomb in true good american fashion the quality is unmatched the stretch is there they feel really comfortable on and yeah these are a pair of jeans that you will literally have in your wardrobe forever so now we're rolling into jackets jackets i have one sweatshirt and then one like button up blouse type shirt so the first one is this really beautiful cloud dreamy blue jacket from free people now free people is always hit and miss for me i feel like they just run too oversized to the point where like i feel as though i am drowning in their clothing now their bralettes and bras i am a huge fan of i've talked about that in um numerous videos but mm, i wish i could like this one but it's just way too oversized for me now i will say that the fabric actually is not too itchy it's not too scratchy um because i know that can be kind of a worry when you go to get a shacket because typically the wool is very irritating on your skin but this one is actually 
really very soft and not that irritating when I had it on. Um, there are some great buttons for the closures. There's a couple utility pockets on the front. Of course, this is a little bit more of like a luxury piece in terms of price, but definitely something you're gonna have in your wardrobe for years to come. I kind of hinted at it already, but I do love the color. This definitely goes with my color scheme and I would consider this blue more of a neutral than anything and I think it looks really good with a light pair of jeans. This would also be more than appropriate for the spring if you live somewhere cool and it's still pretty cold in the spring months. This would be really cute with like a long midi dress, like a ribbed midi dress or something like that. I can definitely see that styled with this. I just don't see myself holding onto this one because it's too oversized for me and they did provide this in a small, I believe. So I'm gonna be passing on this one, but if you're in the market and you like your, either your things super oversized or if you're larger in size than me, I think you would really enjoy this one. Next is like a jacket, sweater, I wouldn't necessarily call it a shacket. Maybe it's a shacket. I don't know. It's kind of a cross between a lot of different things. This particular one is from Vici. I know Vici just started working with Nordstrom within the last year to six months. And this one is butter. The quality is insane. It's so thick, so heavy. There's such a great weight to it. This is one you can wear in the office. You can wear in a date night. You can wear it for literally any occasion in the fall, winter, spring months. It's so cozy. I do not know what the blend of this fabric is, but if I find out, I will put it on the sc screen because it is so heavenly. I want a blanket in this material. The one thing I will say is one of my biggest pet peeves is when the pocket is not fully sewn onto the sweater or jacket because then sometimes it like just flops around and looks very undone or just like unfinished in my opinion. So that is one of my big pet peeves. This is a little bit too big on me as the free people one is. It just looks like I'm drowning in it. it doesn't look tailored. It doesn't look like it's the right size at all, but I do think this is their smallest size. This is in a small and I could definitely use like an extra extra small. So with that being said, this isn't going to work for me, but I would highly recommend this one. The fabric is just so luxe and this is definitely a piece that you will get years and years and years of wear out of. And that's the one thing I will say about Nordstrom, even though their pricing can be a little bit more on the steep end, their pieces are gonna be ones that are gonna be in your closet for such a long time. This sweatshirt is so fun. And this is one that I actually swapped for something else that was in the trunk or that was curated curated in my trunk for me. I saw this one and I wanted to try it so bad. I think it is so cute. I've never heard of this brand before. It's called Only Life, but it has these little hearts on it. They have broken hearts and then just the regular yellow heart. It's so vibrant, so cute, so playful. It could be a really fun, obviously Valentine's Day sweatshirt, but you could wear it up super funky with some like little alien buns and just make it super playful. I don't think your wardrobe has to be so serious or so neutral all the time. It is really fun to add these like little pops of color in your wardrobe when you're in the mood. And yeah, I just couldn't say no to this one. It is a little bit lighter and a little bit more cropped, so it's not super oversized by any means. They do have like dolman type sleeves where it's wider towards the shoulder and then it gets more tapered at the wrist. And this is a lighter weight sweatshirt. So if you live in a climate that's warmer like Texas or Arizona, you could definitely get away with wearing this fall, winter, spring, summer, maybe not in the summer, but you know what I mean. Yeah, I just love this one. If you guys like this one too, leave me a little pink or yellow heart down below because I think it's so cute. Last but not least, in terms of apparel, I do have one pair of shoes. This is a really pretty button down uh, blouse or shirt from Treasure and Bond. Treasure and Bond makes some of my favorite button downs and I've mentioned this numerous times on my channel. I may be a broken record at this, at this point, but there is nothing that makes me feel more put together, more comfortable, more like myself than a button down shirt. I don't know what it is, but it just is that way. And this is in a size small. I love this 
fabric it almost has like a cooling touch to it you could definitely dress this one up with black jeans and black booties and wear it to the office it would look so pretty with the gold on Luisa jewelry because of just the neutral colors in it so it's black with some like honey brown and some cream it almost has like a Burberry type of color scheme going on but I feel like it's the perfect length to cover your butt so you could wear it with leggings or like faux leather leggings would look killer with this and some over the knee boots yes that is a look right there for sure it has two large utility pockets on the front and i feel like you just cannot go wrong with a shirt like this i know the last shirt was very vibrant and fun but having staples like this in your closet are essential just to grab and go depending on any occasion whether you work in the office or if you're going on a date night or a girls night or whatever these pieces are so essential to have in your wardrobe so this one is definitely worth the money in my opinion the quality is very very nice Last but not least are these shoes from Treasure and Bond as well. So these are like a more pointed, rounded pointed booty. These are $80, I believe, which are actually a really decent price for these. Yeah, they're $79.95. So these are actually a really good quality boot for such a great price. There is some really pretty hardware on the back, this like platinum or silver hardware. I do like there's a pole so you can get it up over your heel. And of course the stretchy size make it very easy to get on and off your foot. This suede is so beautiful and will go with so many different looks. The heel is nice. It's not too high. It's not too short. Um, more than appropriate to wear to work in my opinion if you have like a more casual dress code. The one thing about these though is I would say they do run very much true to size. I am typically a size seven and a half. They sent these to me in a seven. So maybe I didn't put the correct size in my trunk club sizing. And I definitely need a half a size bigger. Maybe if I wore thinner socks, but I do love my thick socks and it just does not work in a size seven. So I would say if you're interested in a boot like this, um, definitely get your true size because they fit true to size. So with all that being said, this wraps up my trunk club unboxing. If you like this video, make sure you give it a big thumbs up. Don't forget to check out Ana Luisa. Again, I will have their website listed down below as well as all the pieces that I have and my discount code. So make sure you go check out their website. I know you will absolutely love their pieces. Again, they have classic styles, more funky styles. If you want to switch things up in your jewelry collection and Plus, they are just amazing gifts specifically for Black Friday. They are running amazing deals for Black Friday. So snag them while you can. Try out their jewelry while they, while they are discounted at a very good price. And I hope you guys, again, enjoyed this video. I hope you're having an amazing day and I will see you